Russian aviation suffered next very painful loss in Ukraine. Recently, the armed forces of Ukraine have often shot down Russian aircraft. On January the 30th, the general staff of the Ukrainian armed forces announced the destruction of another Russian Su-34 fighter jet over the Luhansk region. The Su-34 aircraft is perhaps the most frequent guest in the statistics of the Ukrainian general staff. Military expert reserve colonel of the armed forces of Ukraine, Petro Chernik, told Channel 24 how the invaders used the fighter and how painful the loss was for them. The Su-34 is one of the newest Russian bombers. According to official information, the aggressor country produced a total of 143 such aircraft, a very serious and significant loss. If my memory serves me right, Ukraine has already destroyed about 30 aircraft. This is a very high figure, Chernik noted. It is from the Su-34 bomber that KH-59 guided missiles are launched. It can carry up to six units. A very sensitive and unpleasant missile, the military expert emphasized. The Su-34 also carries adjusted KAB-500 aerial bombs, up to six units and modern UPAB-1500B. Guided aerial bombs, up to three units, the most complex weapons that cannot be shot down. Cabs are launched from a distance of 40 to 70 kilometers. It's impossible to fight bombs. When it comes out of the pylon and takes a combat course, it will definitely reach the target, but the carrier must and can be fought. The fact that we have found algorithms for shooting them down is simply remarkable, Chernik said. According to him, every year, it will be more and more difficult for Russians to build such machines.